Today we're going to be looking at the claw hook hi-hat mount from Drum Workshop. This is part of DW's factory accessories line, which includes a ton of creative options for mounting all sorts of drums, cymbals, and percussion accessories to your drum kit. This unit comes with three parts, a claw hook mount, a mini boom arm, and an auxiliary hi-hat mount with DW's incremental hi-hat clutch. I was able to purchase this from Sweetwater for just under $80. The setup for this system is super easy. You simply mount the claw hook to any bass drum, tighten, and then add the hi-hat arm to that claw hook after. DW seems to do a nice job of making their mounts extremely sturdy and durable, so you can trust this isn't going to be sliding around at all. In this video, you'll see me demo this product with a pair of 8-inch hi-hats near the center of the bass drum, followed by a pair of 13-inch hi-hats. I'll show you a few options you have for expanding the use of the included pieces, and then I'll share some of my thoughts and a few tips on getting the most out of it. As you can see, the hi-hat seat includes two felts and a small thumb screw to secure the bottom hat to the seat of the mount. I wasn't able to thread the thumb screw when using the 8-inch hats due to the small distance from bell to bell and the clutch getting in the way, but it's a nice feature for these 13-inch hats. You also may notice the 13-inch symbols pretty much use the full extent of the hi-hat rod, so I don't know if you'd be able to use anything much bigger than a 13 or 14-inch pair of hi-hats, but that all depends on the profile of your symbols. One of the things I really like about this setup is the ability to remove the hi-hat portion of this stand and thread it onto a cymbal stand for more unique setups and more ideal placement. With the 13 inch hats I was able to move it over the floor tom and make a setup for an easy solution to playing a groove with toms mixed in it. While using the hi-hat mount on a cymbal stand, you can also still find other applications for the claw hook and the boom arm. I was able to fit an old L-arm into the claw hook and used it for a much more secure way to mount cowbells, wood blocks, and other percussion accessories. Another idea I really like is to take the claw hook to the front of your bass drum and thread a microphone or a mic clip onto the boom arm and position this for a bass drum microphone. If you go to DW's website, you can find a whole slew of attachments that fit this system and you can create endless opportunities to discreetly mount your accessories without adding any cymbal stands to your setup. Now for my final thoughts, would I recommend this product? Yes. Although $80 seems like a pretty steep price for a small mounting piece, there's a lot of engineering in this and it's extremely reliable. Plus, with the option to add on other mounts through either DW or your own supply of different hardware, the possibilities are endless. A lot of today's leading drummers seem to be adding on either stacks or auxiliary hats into their setup. Being able to conveniently mount them can be a challenge without adding extra stands onto the ground. I love this idea and it's no surprise that it was developed by DW artist Dave Elich. There's a great video of him on DW's YouTube channel playing with this and I'll have that linked below. If you enjoy this content, please consider liking this video and subscribing to my channel. If you've ever used an auxiliary hi-hat or stack on your kit, leave a comment down below letting me know how you mounted it, and if you think this mount would work good with your setup. Thanks, and I'll catch you in the next one.